Hey guys! So I got a lot of requests for videos, so I thought that I'd film one today. So I want to talk about STEM toys because that's my favorite part of being alive is to have STEM toys. So I wanted to show you my favorite ones. So this is my STEM toy. I would call it my sensory basket, but it's where I keep all my STEM toys. And you've seen a lot if you've been on my Instagram before, but um, this is one that I got at a toy store. And this has got to be one of my absolute favorites because that just feels so nice. It just gives you something to focus on. And, um, it, like, rolling it helps me talk better, I guess. I don't know if I'm talking better right now, but I, I'm not having to process, like, the words going through my head. I'm just talking, like, stream of consciousness. So, um, my thoughts aren't really getting in the way of what I'm saying. So that's kind of one of the benefits that this does, how that works with my brain. Uh, anything squishy. I have uh, Miss Puffy Muffy, a little cake. Um, I have the green one my sister gave me, the blob, the Nido. This is great. <laughs> I'm just gonna do a whole like spiel on that. Um, boy. But this is so cool. My mom got it for me for Christmas. Come on. And it changes color from pink to purple. And this one I just kind of zone out to. Really good squish. This I made. And... I just kind of bring it to the park sometimes when I would go and lay in the park and I just watch it go in the sunlight. It's super pretty in the sunlight. Um, this uh, is no mash. There's no match for my teeth. I really need more chews. Uh, if anyone needs me to test out any of your stims uh, that involve chewing, I am your girl because I got some sharp ones. <laughs> and then this. The Aaron's Thinking Putty. If you can see that. It's nice because it's purple and shiny. So that when I play with it, then it's kind of mesmerizing to look at. And this, I'll literally sit for like an hour and just stretch it. And just get lost in the sensory seek. So I am a major sensory seeker because um, I also have ADD so I'm always like fidgeting and moving about and um, I have hyposensitivity mm, so I want to explain that a little more later but um, I'm always seeking out stimulation. This one, like just on this finger, this finger right here, that's the, that's the stuff. Those are the good vibes. <laughs> Uh, this has just turned into a show you my sensory box, uh, it's not my sensory basket, uh, in entire video, so it's not even my favorite stims anymore. Well, they're all my favorite stim toys, <laughs> let's just be honest, I love all of them. Angle. This is nice because it makes that nice clickety-clackety noise. If you can appreciate that, then you'll like adding one of these to your collection, if you don't like that noise, then they do make metal ones, I think, that are, like, really quiet. Because, like, unless you intentionally, like, clack it together, the metal ones, they're just, like, fluid. So they're a lot better for people who don't like the noise. Everybody's gotta have slime. Even the neurotypicals are taking over the slime. And personally, I'm here for it because that just makes slime more available. Um, this isn't kind of dry, actually. But it's pink and it's got glitter in it, so... There's that. <laughs> this was the first type of stim toy thing I ever bought myself. And I got it in a Target at a baby section, and it's like for new mothers to wear. I got glitter all over myself. For new mothers to wear so their babies can chew on this rubber necklace instead of expensive jewelry. And I've indented it with my teeth, but... Um, I don't use it that much anymore. I don't want to put that on the ground. 
Uh, and here's a little makeup bag. I have a bunch of little things that might get lost if I just dump them straight in here. Um, zipper bracelet. This is my favorite. Okay, so when I was like 16 or 17, I found a zipper bracelet on the ground in this old abandoned warehouse that I was visiting, like for no apparent reason, just with some friends, which is not something I did very often. Uh, visiting abandoned warehouses, I actually did that quite a lot, but hanging out with friends, I didn't do much of that, actually. Um, and I just found, like, a zipper bracelet on the ground in the dirt. <laughs> and so I was just picking up, I was just, like, zipping it like crazy, and I just, like, oh, and this is before I even knew I was autistic. This was years ago. And <laughs> I just, like, kept it until it broke, and I was really upset. And then when I saw these, I was like, it's the thing. <laughs> so that's... This is one of my favorites. Um, this my therapist gave me, a little acupressure ring. And I'm actually gonna be writing a description for one of these for a, um, a, to a stim toy company. And I've already had practice. <laughs> so that one's nice, it's really small. Um, these little guys, they're all colorful, <gasps> fuzzy. And then just Kind of loud, but I like them. And then also, grapefruit essential oil, because smelling is a stim. And grapefruit improves mood and scares away depression. Lavender satchel, which smelling is a stim. I don't remember. This is so cute. It's a little cat sleep mask, and my mom got it for me for Christmas. It's so soft. This is, he's a kitty cat, and he's so soft. Let's do this one first. This is one that my mom got me for Christmas, and I can't play with it with nails because it's like Play-Doh? Clay? Molding clay? Um, it's... It smells nice. Um, but it's very, very blue. So I have to be careful with what I use on that. Because it will stain. <laughs> and then, last but not least, the kinetic sand. And this, I have nails, so I'm gonna be careful. Try and grab it and not get it underneath my nails. But this is what I do to zone out and just take a sensory break. I'll just... Such a good noise, too. What was my other... Oh! My squishy... My, my mom calls them my, my gooey guys. M lots of my Stim toys are from Stimtastic, but these, these are from Stimtastic. There's a little seal. He stretches, he squishes, he's gooey. I have cute cat paw print. This is the cutest. It's so nice. Are you toe beans? Uh, he glows uh, in the dark if I put him on a light and let him absorb some light and then bring him in a dark room. He's glow in the dark. He's so squishy. That's one of my stims, making that weird noise. Weird, weird noise. That weird voice <laughs> in the cloud. This I named after my friend Hope because I don't know. It just reminded me of my friend Hope. Like, squishy, squishy. My new stim toy. I'm having fun with. Kind of. It's got good chew to it, but I don't want to break it. So that's nice to have around. I'm gonna end this video before I get lost in this. Too late. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I love making YouTube videos. This is really fast, and this I just was like, but lighting is good. Why don't I have? Why don't I do it? So, if it turns out okay, I'm gonna put it on YouTube. All right. I love you guys. Bye.